cell phone, aka mobile device, again, back at it with Pokemon Quest. Now, you're probably wondering, why is the title, I'm so dumb, or whatever the hell it was? Well, I mean, I'm pretty damn dumb. I did not do what I said I was going to do, and I had two weeks to do it, and we could be leveling up super duper fast right now, but sadly, I forgot about it completely. We're about to get into it, and I will show you guys what I mean by that. So, last time where we left off, um, we are recapping Expedition 3. Uh, we've done a lot of leveling and all that type of cool stuff. I did say it was going to be something different, because I only play this on Sundays at the moment. Except last week, when it was open beta for Call of Duty Blackout. That's the only time I didn't play it. What happened was, I was supposed to log in every single day and collect the daily Pokemon where the Psyduck, as you guys can see, appears. And that would have given us a lot of Pokemon. That would have given us 14 total Pokemon that we could have used, or <clears throat> used towards leveling, or used in general. And sadly, I completely forgot about it. So, still basically grinding the basic expeditions to uh, get us some cooking uh, regions, but... Uh, Starting tomorrow, I will go ahead and make sure I log in every single day because I do want to go ahead and level up as much as possible. So it's been a couple of weeks. Um, it's been, yeah, it's been two weeks. So I'm going to go ahead and check out what what's going on, what's missing, uh, what have I forgotten. The only thing I do remember is I am recapping Expedition 3 now. Um, a lot of Pokemon Quest episodes have been released by now. I believe we're on like episode around 15. Uh, so go ahead and check them out. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, check out the uh, the in-game stuff on types of things that I can do on the side while I am doing these expeditions. Uh, just looking at uh, basic achievements for main and challenges. Also, i got to go ahead and check out what Pokemon I even got to right now. Because I do get a lot at the campsite. But the reason being is I'm storing them. What's up, Dark uh, Dust Cinder Maya? I haven't seen you in a long time. Um, but thank you very much for tuning in. I'm storing these Pokemon uh, just because I can't be bothered to uh, do what I've been doing in the past. So I'm trying to store these Pokemon as much as possible. That level 59 Ponyta is lit, but it's not good at all. Um, so bear with me. We are still trying to level up Raichu. We are still grinding up uh, Regents to go ahead and do uh, cooking with. Um, so that's why we're doing the basic expeditions at the moment in time. Uh, we did Expeditions 1 three weeks ago, we did Expedition 2 two weeks ago, now we're doing Expedition 3, all the way until we have caught up, and once we have caught up, we probably collected a lot of Pokemon to where, um, we will actually be able to start storming through, uh, what we're currently stuck at. Alright, so nothing new at the store, that kinda sucks. It's all good, it's all good. Glad to see you back. Uh, so 300, 300, 300, 300, 500, 200. Alright, so we can get that Charmander fact finally. Uh, let's go ahead and pick up that. That's another item that we can go ahead and bring to the squaw. Alright, please. Did I purchase it? I purchased it, right? Oh, I, I did quit. My bad. Sweet. Oh, what is that? Your delivery has arrived. Premier Pokeball. Uh, this effect is active. PM tickets received as a service for members. Plus 10. As a special gift for getting a total of 10 decorations from the Pokemon, you get a premiere. Oh my gosh, that is so... So wait, hold up. If I go to here, don't you get that from purchasing this? Oh no, that's the other Pokeballs. Alright, so never mind. Never mind. I'm, I'm completely stupid, completely lost. It's all good. Oh, what's up, a random Gyor? How do you pronounce that G-Y-O-R? Gyor or... G-Y-O-R? <laughs> what... What's up with the name now? Alright, can I put, uh... My Charmander, my Charmander flag out? That. That. Yeah, I wanna put that- Oh, I can't put that there, really? Um... Mm, <laughs> this isn't cool. Not cool at all, fam. I'm, I'm kind of upsetty Mom Spaghetti right now. Alright, so we're gonna put that there. Because Charmander's cool enough to have his own. Surfboard. Is going to have to go out front. And then we'll... I was actually, no. We'll put the put the surfboard in the other spot. Like, Gior. Gior. Okay. Gior. Got you. Got you, fam. Alright. We'll put the surfboard on that side. We'll put the Pokeball on the other side. Where is that Pokeball? Premier Pokeball. So, we're going to get more PM tickets. And how? How does it work? 
how 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 do how do how do do how do you do things, fam? All right, well I get more. I get more PM. That, that actually looks pretty damn cool, though. Our base camp's coming alive now. Base camp coming alive. Let's go ahead and get straight into the expedition now. So as you all know, we are currently stuck on expeditions 7, 8, 9, and 10. Um, I don't have any reasons to go ahead and do them. I am going to go check the cooking, see how far I am from being able to cook again. I have no reasons to do expeditions 7 through 10 at the moment. I just don't have a good enough team. I am close. I am close. Uh, and, uh, yeah. Alright, so let's see. One, two. So if I auto set that. We're close. Alright, so you already have... Do you want to stop cooking? Do you want to stop cooking? Yes. Alright, so let's get into some expeditions. Let's get some cooking regents. And uh, hopefully be able to get some cooking in before we stop. Expeditions 1 and 2 have been uh, re-accomplished and re-completed. We're now going to move on to Expedition 3. And uh, again, we're also doing this to get some levels and experience points now into Raichu. We don't have Pikachu anymore, but this is now a surfing Raichu. And um, we're trying to get XP on Raichu to level that up a little bit, as well as getting these cooking regions to get more Pokemon to go ahead and level my main Pokemon up. Alrighty, everybody, back forth Brook, Expedition 3. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into level 1 of Expedition 3, which requires a uh, total team points of uh, 1,100. As you guys can tell, I'm currently at 3,100 with just Flareon and Raichu, who don't even have gems, I don't even think. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this quickly. I think I, I think Flareon has the gems. Raichu, I know, definitely doesn't. What's up, Sylveon? Thank you very much for tuning in. So, we're just going to go ahead and auto-complete this. This, shouldn't, this should be Cakewalk. I need, I need, I need a lot of cooking regents because I'm in dire need of cooking. I'm in dire need of a lot of Pokemon. And also, for those of you tuning in... Starting today or this week, I'm going to be logging in every single day and collecting the daily Pokemon. Now, if I would have done that since the beginning, I would have probably had over a thousand Pokemon. No, probably about 500 Pokemon. Uh, that, that's it. That's an exaggeration too. So how long have I been playing? So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I would have had roughly about 150 different Pokemon. Not different, but 150 Pokemon that I could have used towards leveling. And I just never... I always thought I wanted you guys to experience everything with me. But I mean, I feel like we're not getting too far into this game now. That we're kind of at a stoppage point with Expeditions 7, 8, 9, and 10. That I need to do some things behind the scenes. And I'm not going to play the game behind the scenes. But I am going to log in every single day and collect a daily Pokemon. And then I will go ahead and use that on the next episode to go ahead and level up my Pokemon. Haven't been breeding for your shiny MW about Alpha Sapphire and I just finished the story. Oh, sweet. Who here wants me to do Let's Play on uh, Pokemon Let's Go? If you're asking me, I've been actually doing pretty damn good. Started up a new channel. A lot of things have changed recently. And it's been going okay. It's kind of slow at the moment, but I got ideas that are going to be coming out soon. So hopefully that picks it up. I got a, a couple of new games that will be taking over the schedule in the next couple of months. Um, I've been playing a lot of World of Warcraft lately. That's not going anywhere because that's just something I really like to do, but yeah. Alright, cool. This one is done. Oh my gosh, 20 freaking cooking regions. I told you guys, get back into the grind on the uh, early expeditions. You get through these so quick. And uh, especially if you out-level them. But that's 20 cooking regions right there. Plus the stones that I'm not going to be able to use because I have no use for them. I can go ahead and turn those into some more cooking regions. So that was a definite plus. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can cook now. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, edit team real quick. Let's get the the mats from those two gems. Club, power charms. Um, recycle, the two basics. And I think that's it. That's not bad at all. That was about 10. 
So do you, you won't see me a lot at least for now. It's all good. It's all good. You gotta gotta feel better. Take care of yourself first, and then you'll be back. Ah, uh, what am I waiting for? Oh yeah, I keep forgetting the cooking. I never remember to do it. All right, so we can definitely cook. Perfect. Let's go ahead and do that. I'm trying to save all of my uh, rainbows, my rainbow agents for something special. So zero out of four. We will be able to get a new Pokemon today. Maybe two. We have gotten a Psyduck today, but not too, not too great because I don't need a water type. All right, Expedition three level two. Uh, team total rating of 1300 is needed. Not necessarily. You can probably do it with a team total of 500 if you really tried, but it recommends 13. So let's go ahead and get into this. Also, for those of you wondering about this uh, expedition, it's a lot of water types, which is why the bonus is grass. And also, for those of you tuning in live, the, the ideas that I have coming up in the next couple of months are simply uh, FIFA 19, The Journey. I'm going to do Season 3 on that. And that is going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with both of my channels. Both of my channels are going to be taking advantage of FIFA. So even if you aren't interested in the gameplay, you might be able to see some IRL stuff on the new channel. So stay tuned for that. Um, so that's FIFA 19. That's going to be coming out in about a couple of days. On the 27th, I believe. Um, we've got next month, I believe, Call of Duty uh, Black Ops 4. I might get into Blackout. That's like last on my list, but I kind of want to see if I can get some views from that. Um, what else do we got? Um, Mario Party. Uh, Super Smash Brothers. And last but not least, uh, Pokemon Let's Go. Those are the five games that I've got in mind to finish this year off. Um, Pokemon Quest, Pokemon Magic Jump, um, World of Warcraft, Overwatch. All of those games are going nowhere. So uh, stay tuned for those. They're, ne they're, they're, they're never going to go anywhere. Those are like my core games. But I'd like to complete Pokemon Quest. I'd like to put that on like the, the shelves of adventures that have been completed. Same with uh, Magikarp. So yeah, we got five new games that will be coming to the channel, for those of you guys wondering. Pokemon Let's Go is going to be a super duper fun uh, adventure with you guys. I have great ideas for it. Um, I'm going to have you guys get involved in that series too while I live stream it. I will be posting uh, questions on Discord and social media to get you guys involved before each and every stream. See what Pokemon you guys want me to capture. I'm not going to be doing all... I'm going to be doing the gameplay, but I want you guys to choose the route and paths that I take. Because that will be cool to go ahead and get everybody involved. So that's Pokemon Let's Go. Most likely going to get Eevee. And then after that, which sucks, I got this Expedition bonus. But uh, that's Pokemon Let's Go. Cannot, that's like, that's the game I'm looking forward to. FIFA 19, that's going to be taking advantage of both of my YouTube channels. I got a new one for those of you that don't know. It's actual for the Winatachi now. Uh, I can't wait. I can't wait for it to come out. You're definitely going to get Eevee, I know that. Unless you get the, the bundle package, you'll be getting both. So FIFA, Pokemon Let's Go. And then of course Mario... Uh, Mario Party is going to be cool. A little fun uh, side game that I can do. Um, Super Smash Brothers, And then last but not least, Call of Duty Black Ops. Alright, Expedition 3, level 3. 1600 total rating. I eat it alive. Let's go ahead and get straight into this. Get these cooking regions in the bag. And then move on to Expedition 4. Probably next week, but we will move on. Unless we get some like super massive battery charge achievement. But I'm so looking forward to Pokemon Let's Go, it's not even funny. It's a Pokemon game on the Switch. It's, I mean, I know I can, I'm going to be playing Pokemon Quest on the Switch as well when I get back to uh, the current expeditions. I'm just recapping all of the old ones on my mobile device, and then I will be switching this series over to the Switch for those of you tuning in. So I will have my webcam and all the, the cool layouts on the Switch when I get that. What else? Um, let's see. I'm. L I hope they make the next generations of Pokemon games available on the Switch. 
That would be so great. It's all good. It's all good, Sylveon. You told me what's going on. I understand it. That's... Wait. Why, how'd you, why don't you use Thundershock half of the time? I don't get this Raichu. It thinks it's cool that, that it knows Surf, but these are water types, fam. You can one-shot them with Thundershock. See? Simple. But I hope they make future generations of Pokemon games uh, available for the Nintendo Switch. Because I really like... I have both. I have a Nintendo 3DS, but... I have the an the 20th anniversary 3DS, um, but I really like to uh, I'd really like to play Pokemon on the Switch. This, just the screen size and everything is just so cool about it. All right, couple more levels here. Expedition 3, level 4. Uh, team total of 1,800. Almost at the boss. This is the uh, the level right before the boss. So let's go ahead and uh, smash through this one as quickly as possible. See what Pokemon... I, I forget these expeditions too. That's kind of another reason why I like going back in time and doing these early expeditions. Because this is basically where the adventure started. Also, don't know if I asked, are you doing more reactions? Possibly. I don't have any planned too much right now. But, um... I most likely will. I'll keep you updated on that though before I do them. So you know which ones I'm doing them on. Rachu Thunder Sh Oh, you don't even have it. Sign cool down. My bad. I can't wait to see what uh, Pokemon Quest looks like on a Switch. I mean, it looks the same, but what does. Uh, how does it feel with actual controllers and stuff? This Flareon is just cakewalking through these expeditions. Also, for those of you tuning in tonight, I will be playing uh, Pokemon Magikarp Jump. We will be doing a live stream on that shortly after this one. As always, it's a very quick game to play, even though Pokemon Quest lately is going to be quick because we're uh, farming older expeditions at the moment. But again, like I said, we are on Expedition 3 Recap. Uh, we got four, five, and six to do, and then once we have gotten back to Expedition Seven, uh, we should be able to complete uh, Expedition Seven, Eight, Nine, and Ten very easily once we have leveled up our, our team the way we are right now. And um, I'm going to be doing those on the Switch. So once I've recapped all of these levels, I will be going back onto the Nintendo Switch or going to the Nintendo Switch to finish off this uh, Pokemon Quest Adventures and Let's Play series. No, my Raichu dieted. Oh my gosh, Flareon's using Flamethrower and a Cloyster, and it's absolutely cooking it. Oh, whoa, the heals, fam. Relax. What sucks is uh, Flareon's auto attack is like 10 times stronger than any of his other attacks. Easy. Hey bro, I want to sponsor you. What's up, Tech BD? Um, that would be great, but sadly I don't have monetization on, on my YouTube channel at the moment. So I do apologize for that. I do thank you very much for your uh, your chat. And uh, if you want to just go ahead and uh, support the channel, just be sure to subscribe to us, man. Thank you very much for tuning in. I used to have monetization on this YouTube channel back in January and February. And then when that whole Logan Paul PewDiePie scene went down and YouTube decided to crack down on monetizations on, tra on smaller YouTube channels, I kind of lost it. But um, I'm almost back. I've got one of the, re um, the requirements completed, which is 1,000 subscribers. Um, total watch time in hours, I'm currently at about 3,000 out of 4,000. So I need 1,000 more hours of watch time in order to remonetize my channel. And then it takes a couple of months because YouTube's really slow at stuff. So yeah, so just wait a bit, guys. Okay, bro, do you have PayPal? I do have PayPal. Um, if you want to go ahead and donate and support the channel, you can. Uh, check out the description box down below. Uh, you should be able to find information on that on how it works. 
I use um, stream elements, which is kind of the layout of my um, my YouTube videos. And uh, basically, uh, donations go through that. You can go on a leaderboard and all that type of stuff if you want to support us. You are close. I am close. I'm almost back at it. I think it's probably about 3,100 hours out of 4,000 by now. Yeah, the, the review, but the review I'll be fine. But it just takes a couple of months. But I'll get I'll get it back quick because I've already been in the monetization before, and also I already know who I'm gonna uh, I already know what network I will be um, re-monetizing with, which would be TGN, and they're gonna help me get back. They just told me to contact them once uh, my channel's ready, so I can kind of bypass most of the review process. Because they're really nice. I used to be monetized with Machinima. However, they were not so nice. And they really didn't help me at all. And what sucks is, I used to be partnered with TGN before they got taken over. And TGN was the same as Machinima. They were both really bad. No customer service. Not very helpful people. But TGN got taken over by Broadband TV. And uh, they have a totally different staff. And then I went back to them and they were so, so nice. What sucks is, I was only with them for... Um, I was only with them for like two months before all the demonetization stuff went down, so that kind of sucked. Um, but yeah, I know I know the review process is very long, uh, but TGN's gonna kickstart mine once I have uh, over 4,000 hours of watch time and I can prove it to them. But they'll be able to look at my channel anyways because they have access to that. The only positive about uh, being partnered with TGN before was that they have... Um, I still, I still kind of talk to them. I can't, they can't do anything for me because I'm not monetized anymore. But um, I still kind of talk to them, so they help me out. So, bro, to be honest, I have a new website and it has like 2k people. If you join 76, oh, what is the website, bro? Yeah, TGN helps a lot. They're really nice people. Well, they're nice people. It's broadband TV now. So I'll probably get, I'll probably get that process quickly quickly finished once I've gotten over the 3k views. I mean the 4k hours of uh, views. TGN, super nice network. Hopefully, hopefully, I mean I know the same guy still works. They were helping me so much. It was the last two, the, the two months I was with them. I got more out of the two months with them than the three years I was with Machinima. <clears throat> By 10,000 10, times. It's not even funny. Machinima did zero to me. Absolutely nothing. TGN was trying to help. They were putting my videos on the on social media. It was it was worth it was worth it. Like the video, all the videos on my channel that have a lot of views, they were they came from Machinima. Like my uh, radiate irradiate video for Overwatch it has like about five thousand views. That's a lot to me right now. Uh, that got pushed out from them. So that was. Definitely something, something to help. Are you, are you really gonna lose, Florian? Come on now. Yay, Sir from a Raichu defeated a Polyrath <laughs> of all things. All right, sweet, perfect. Expedition three completed. All right, let's go ahead and recycle all of these stones real quick because that's gonna be needed. Uh, we can actually get the cooking done too. Uh, this is perfect. What's the website about? I don't mind giving it a look. Alright, so let's go ahead and recycle. Hopefully we get a lot of cooking regions because they're definitely needed right now. Perfect. Not bad at all. Alright, get out of here. Go ahead and see what Pokemon we have uh, picked up and see if we can put some more cooking on to the into the cooking pot. What type of moveset do you want your Sylvia on? I'm going to make it battle ready once I find the shot. Oh, snap. Alright, well, let's, yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Let's go do the cooking first and then we'll finish our last expedition. Please give me something good. I'm be upsetty. Ooh, hot pata la cube, but it's good. It's not great. It's gonna be a fire type, which is a good plus for me. It's another freaking ponytail. Oh my gosh. 
Do you know eight ball pool? I do not. Oh my, whoa, 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 whoa. An, a level eight ponytail. What is this? Why is it so bad? What the hell? If you find a way to hurry the process of review or some kind, let me know. I've been stressed over this lately. Well, I know how to hurry up the process, but... It, your channel would have to be a gaming channel to partner with TGN, but I can see what they can do. Uh, yeah, let's um, reset that really quick. I want a randomized one, auto set. But I don't want that to be used. Throw in the yellow. There we go. Oh, what? Five... Fine, let's go ahead and do this expedition. It'll be worth it. Expedition 4, but I'm not using this for video prop purposes. I'm just getting straight into it. That Pikachu surfboard effect, it just said, increases the chances of multiple Pokemon. Um... That can be attracted by the cooking. That's only happened once. Uh, go to one of my social media pages. My Gmail is on that. Or go to my YouTube channel. For the one that actually plays. You can find my Gmail over there. I can't type it right now. It's a, it's an open... It's an open Gmail. It's an open email account that I use for stuff like that. It's not attached to anything. I just use it to read email or receive. It's like my main one. It's so annoying having multiple emails and you have to remember all these password things. All right, well, we're getting through this pretty. Oh, what? You had to use flurry on. I mean, flamethrower that way. That wasn't nice. Magic carb jump, man. I wonder. I really don't remember where I left off in that game. The flamethrower is just so bad. I wish you could turn off a move while it's on autoplay, like just so it doesn't use it. Hey, no, this was actually a pretty not so easy level. I remember this one back, back in the day. Two months ago, it probably was. Oh my gosh. The combos. The water and fire type combos. Yeah, the team doesn't know what it's doing right now. Oh, the 4300 crit. Flamethrower, this is like the best time. It's just sitting there. Okay, that works too. How's the XP looking now with uh, Raichu? Oh, it's actually getting a pretty decent amount of XP now. Alright, that's perfect. So it's roughly at the, the correct level. This is where a team of Raichu's level would be normally. Alright, good to know. Might do another expedition, not 100% sure just yet. I'm gonna see what I can do leveling wise. Alright. One thing that irritates me about this game is remembering to back up. Oh man, I was almost there. Not really, but I was close. There was one uh, there was one achievement I was trying to get that I thought I would have been able to get today, but I didn't get it. Almost at 50 out of 150 Pokemon, so almost a third there through that.
All right, what's the next one? I'm gonna get three, 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 five, seven, four, two. So I'm gonna get the Victory Bell Golf Bag next. Tiger Woods all day, every day. Um, yeah, let's go to Edit Team and see what we can do leveling. That level eight though, it's so bad. Oh, yes, this is what I needed. This is what I needed. Alright, cool. That's perfect. Alright, so I didn't want to waste all of my ponytail. So what if I switch this one out for that one? 93. Okay, I'll take the 93. Um, we need to get rid of takedown. So start training. That's a 93% chance. You cannot fail, fam. You cannot fail. Oh, please be it. Yes. Oh my gosh. We just got genius. Fire Blast. You don't even know. You don't even know. Fire Blast, Flamethrower, Flareon's now a god. I can't believe it. The, the one move that I needed, and I got it. Alec, oh, my, I, I, don't, I don't even need the Flareon anymore. I don't even need the Flareon anymore. I mean, the, uh, the Ponytail. Oh, that was great. Move learning, you're done. Uh, what level can I get you to? 45, not bad at all. Um, that's 21% on you. 25%. I am going to go ahead and just utilize you to level up. So that's two levels on that. Uh, start training. Perfect. It was so worth. It was so worth. See, I told you. I'm preparing for expeditions 7 through 10. And we're getting there. We're getting there. Per that was the best training sesh of all times right there. Alright, now let's go ahead and uh, power charm this one up. Gonna be needed. I gotta check out Fire Blast though, real quick. Um, use the sprays and all consuming fire on the ground, damaging enemies hit by it, sometimes burning them. Alright, sweet. Just gonna recycle real quick. Um, I don't want that anymore. Okay, so this is move wait time. That is definitely on that. Um, move wait time. Number of move reps. Move wait percent up. Attack width. Number of shots. Move attack percent. Effect duration is increased. Decre oh, okay, I see. Um, what do I want to do then? Repetitions, attack width. The width on that would be really nice. Wish I could put two. I'm going to go sunburst on that. And let's go ahead and switch this out. That's a perfect setup for that one. Go ahead and check out Alakazam real quick. Alakazam's kind of falling behind now. It kind of sucks. Um, number of move repetitions. Percent time. So that's on Psybeam. Okay. Don't care too much for Psybeam. But I would like to keep it going. I can't use the sharing stone. Number of shots, repetitions, attack percent, wait time. What's the wait time? It's already at seven. That's already that's bad. That's no. That's not what you want. I'll go ahead and do that for now. It's a little bit of a buff, but not too much. And then let's go ahead and check out Cloyster real quick. Alright, so I can't use that anyways. Cloister's fine. And that's on Icicle Crash. The user drops frigid icicles. On oh, I forgot about that. 
Alright, cool. Um... Okay, no, that's fine, because it's only a 5 on that. So that's fine. And then the repetition is okay. That's perfect. Alright, so that's pretty much it for Pokemon Quest on this episode. But again, I will be collecting every single day from now on an additional Pokemon to go ahead and help me level up this game and get through it as quickly as possible. Thank you all very much for tuning in. I will be back for those of you tuning in live right now in just a couple of seconds. So bear with me and catch you guys in just about a minute.